I have turned every single living being in the game into Renala's ex-husband slash wife slash consort. Run! Oh, Radagon Sentinel! Oh my... Okay! Who even knows? I basically turned everything into the final boss, Radagon. That means enemies, Radagon. Goats, Radagon. Bosses, Radagon. All the Radagons are scaled to the level of the area that they are in, meaning that Radagons in the starting area won't be as powerful as in the late game areas. You will see shortly though that that hardly matters though. <laughs> so everything clear? Cool. I'm gonna try to beat the entire game like this. I won't do all the remembrances cause that will probably take just forever, but I will do some of the extra bosses. Oh and subscribe if you enjoy these stupid videos of mine. Thanks. With all that said, let's get into it. In any case, let's actually go and get our horse torrent. I don't know how difficult or easy that's going to be, but we're gonna try. Uh, maybe not going to the church immediately is a good idea, actually. Jesus Christ. They immediately aggro! Like <laughs> you. Okay. <laughs> oh, my favorite boss. My absolutely favorite boss. Okay. They have, they, oh! They do friendly fire. Okay, nice. Good to know. What I have to use? They, they, they are super aggressive. Use the terrain to your advantage, Jesus. Jesus. Uh, rather gonna... No! <laughs> For the sake of experimentation, let's try to go into the lake and see how many Radagons we have to deal with over there. Let's go down and see! Oh my god, there's a lot of Radagons here. There is a... Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay, the Radagons do not joke around. Okay, there's a Rad... Oh shit, Radagon incoming. Oh, the teleporting Radagon. What the hell is that? The ritual of Radagon, oh my god. Okay, there's way too many Radagons in the lake. There is no way we are going to get through the lake. That is just not happening. <laughs> okay, the lake is impossible. So I was able to get very close to the church. I think, like, just trying to book it to the church is probably the best way to do it. No! No! Yep. Okay. Christ, Christ, Christ. No! What the hell? No stamina. Yes! First hurdle. Ka Kale, I don't. You don't know how. You don't know how much I like to see you right now. <laughs> this is just amazing. I don't think we actually made any progress, guys. I think we just gotten into deeper and deeper waters. To be perfectly honest with you. Yep. So many other ones in this place. Making all the wildlife Radagon was a mistake! Getting to anything is almost impossible! <laughs> you don't realize how many enemies, uh, how many, how much wildlife is in Elden Ring until you do this to the game. <laughs> Use the trees to your advantage. Okay, I think this is a safe spot here. Oh wait, this is a safe spot. This is a safe spot! Safe spot number two. Cave. Killing Radagon is going to be the most important thing here. One down. How much souls does he actually give? Oh, he gives only 300 souls. Nice. Okay, I think... I think running through here is actually safe. I don't think there's any wild out here anymore. Torrent acquired. Torrent acquired. Run, 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 Oh my god. Look at the range of these guys. Jesus. Alright, let's think about this, guys. We got the first main object. What do we need now? We need to get to the dragon. So I'm guessing going to the third church is probably the best idea here. Let's see how this is going to go. Torrent thing. Oh my god. Okay, going through here is impossible. <laughs> okay, going through here is an absolute mistake. Oh my god, what? Okay. Thank you, Radagon. Run, horse, run! My. Horse dead. I'm dead. Everything is dead. Okay, let's try going through the front gate. Mistake, immediately regret. Okay. Oh! <laughs> I get immediately stunlocked, yeah. Oh, fuck! <laughs> I think those were goats before, but now they're just Radagons. I know there's a Grace somewhere over here. Yeah, yeah, Grace, Grace, Grace! Pop the Grace! Perfect! Bye bye, Radagons. Can you survive this fall? Oh my god! Those were jellyfish! You know, fast traveling doesn't work here, because we are in spawn kill territory. Going back is not an option. So it appears that by turning every single thing into Radagon is proving to be quite impossible to overcome. Mainly because there is no bloody way to actually run away from even a single one of these bastards. 
As a compromise then, me and Machete decided that we are gonna restart the run and just turn every enemy and boss into Radagon. That way the wildlife won't change and then the outlook of completing this run will look much much better. Don't worry though, there will still be plenty of holy lightning throwing, wife abandoning Radagons around. So the birds are birds, okay you are no longer Radagons, I'm so much glad right, look at how much less we had to deal with right here. Like I think I earned this, I think I earned it <laughs> so that the goats are no longer Radagons, yeah. Okay, this place is still horrible, but going around might be actually a lot better now. Oh my, thank god these goats are not rather going, oh my god. I'm just gonna feel relief right now for the rest of the stream, honestly. Passing by the blockade of Radagons like here, like getting to Margit might be legitimately scary. We saw how we saw how Radagons can pretty much just destroy me if they're in a big group. I can fight one-on-one -on -one Radagons, that's not too scary. All of those challenge runs have prepared me for exactly this moment here. This is the exact moment that I've been preparing for. Get by my boy. This is why you cannot avoid other ones. Their range is astronomical. And their homing missiles are homing. Look at this! I can't even see him anymore and he still hits me. There is also a talisman we can grab over here that's going to be essential. But let me actually check first how hard it is to get to... The dragon. Black Blade Radagon, okay. Just go away. Get me to the round table, yes. <laughs> I was not prepared for this. <laughs> this is scored. This is why I randomized the armor of the NPCs. <laughs> you cannot go wrong with this. Okay, now we need to find places where Radagons are not lurking about. Do not aggro the Radagons. Don't really care about golden seeds! Oh yeah, these Radagons are actually really powerful. <laughs> Let's see if we can do this. <laughs> okay, I think this is impossible. Okay, let's change directions. Let's get this. Mistful Ruins. Let's, let's first pick up the Talisman and Mistful Ruins. I don't think we're gonna be able to get the medallions, guys. Spiked Cracked Tear. That's our first like major item that we need. There is a big group of Radagons over to my right. Another important item. Axe Talisman. I'm certainly positive that Fort Hyde would be impossible. This looks impossible. Maybe I can e maybe I can at least get the golden seed. Yeah, going into a zone with a lot of other ones is not a good idea. <laughs> yes! Golden seed acquired, perfect. Oh my god. Okay, this board fight is not gonna be taken. Ah <laughs> uh, yes. Beautiful. Caleb indeed, just as I remember it. There is four Radagons in the shack, okay. This is the Radagon shack. What in the f- <laughs> Guys! What the hell is that? That's the battalion of Radagons, okay. We're just gonna avoid that. Look to my- just- just as like I'm passing the street, I need to look to my left and I need to look to my right. We need to be very careful not to aggro one of these Radagons. Okay, we got a new Dragon Barrel. That is huge. The get, the getting to Dragon Barrel is monumental. Yeah, baby. There we go. Maybe we can clear out every one of these Radagons one by one. Yep, I don't think this is a good idea at all. Let's go get a bleed weapon, let's go kill Grail so we can actually... Uh, we have a couple of options. I'm gonna get the Morning Star. Uh, I think there is a Spirit Spring somewhere over there, so I can use the Spirit Spring to get to some places. Yeah, there it is, perfect. This way we can actually get to the Weeping Peninsula, hopefully. Seems safe enough. There is a Sentinel Radagon. Oh my god, there is a bunch of Radagons. Oh my god, oh... Stop it! That pack of other ones is trouble. Maybe get to the Evergal? How we, how am I going to pass the bridge? I haven't actually thought this through, honestly. Maybe I can bait the other ones to fall down. Maybe. Jesus. I forgot how many attacks another one just has. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Wait, did the other ones fall down? Oh yeah, they fell down. Oh nice. Hold on! <laughs> Goodbye, Radagon. <laughs> I'm actually managing somehow to do this, guys. I don't know how, but I'm managing. This Radagon is not scary. Maybe stealth does work. Curious. Open. Yeah! Mission accomplished. This is mu this is the most important part right now. Leveling up. Five Dragon Hearts and 10,000 souls. Okay, that health part is looking much better right now. The hell is this? Why are there ghost Radagons here? Alright boys, time to actually get to Margit. After two and a half hours. 
What did I go? What did I? I'm I'm confused sometimes about their aggro range. Honestly, this sometimes doesn't make sense. It's time to summon the wolves. <laughs> I can't move. Okay, torrent is not the way to go here. If I go on torrent, they immediately stagger lock me to death. They destroy the barricade. Not good. I'm the master of dodging. <laughs> I'm not the master of surviving, though. I'm making it through, guys. I'm forcing my way through. Quit out. Yes. That was way too much anxiety inducing. <laughs> Hello, Radagon. Long time no see. Radagon has a nice battle flow to him. That's why I really like fighting him when I play a melee character. If I play a melee character against Radagon, I always like fighting him. You have fought well. Until now. First major boss down, guys. Oh my god, I love how the corpses just stay over here. <laughs> the question is, is Stormfield Castle easier than going around? I think going around is easier. Like, however I look at it. <gasps> ah, death by Radagon and gravity. Such a wonderful sight. Why are the Radagons stuck in the walls? <laughs> what is going on over here? What is this? Stalagmites, whatever it's called. Let's actually pick up Alexander as well. I mean, kill Alexander. Man, Square Up is just an absolute disaster of weapon art. Sorry, my boy, but I need your insides. <laughs> Why am I stuck? Oh, this has to be a joke, right? I'm dead. <laughs> what the hell is going on? Okay, this guy is just refusing to give me the path to Lyurnia, it seems. No, Radagon, you asshole. There we go, one down. Ah, oh, Christ. It's not good. Yes! Guys, we are... I think we are safe. Don't kill me. Don't kill me from some weird angle, please. Alright, I feel much better now. <laughs> we have gotten, finally, to Lyurnia. If you don't get the Serpent Hunter, we're gonna go to Gale Tunnel. We're gonna get the Moon Veil. Pretty much the second best option that we can actually deal with Radagons. I want to get to the Purified Ruins and over here. Then we can use the Teleporter and avoid all of the Radagons in the lake. This Teleporter pretty much lets us go directly into Raya Lakaria without having to worry about too much. Let's get the key first, and then we'll figure out on our way how to deal with everything. Let's get the key. Alright, the Academy is probably going to be an absolute disaster, because there is going to be like hundreds of Radagons inside of there. Okay, alright, I'm alive, somehow. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this could be a spawn kill. Oh shit, this is actually not good. This is why this is not good. Oh, this is not a good place to be in. Okay, these Radagons are for some reason passive. I'll take... Oh, these guys are definitely not passive though. Oh my god. Okay. It could be possible to get through. We're gonna get through eventually. So trying to avoid them is like... Yeah, 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 yeah. He'll... How my life? Oh, he's shooting through walls. Okay. When they start shooting through walls, then that's really when all hell breaks loose. Light load OP. We can now try... To do two things. Going into Volcano Manor is quite risky because we can get stuck over there if you don't manage to get to a grace, which is highly possible. Let's try to get to the Red Wolf. Let's see what you got. Radagon of Radagon. Oh my god. I knew that was going to happen, but I love that name. That's like the best thing right now that happened to me. What the hell is going on? The Radagons outside can shoot me from outside. Okay, this is not good. This is not fair. In the slightest. Oh my fucking... Gale Tunnel might be our only, like, viable option here to get the Moon Veil. There should be two Radagons. There is actually one Radagon. Perfect. Gale Tunnel. I don't want to sit on the grace because it's going to be very risky to get out. These Radagons are pretty passive, though. Oh, yeah, baby, we're gonna get the Moon Veil. <laughs> Woo! He should be dead. Yeah, that's a good rule. We actually get a dragon heart here? That's cool, but we get the moon whale, which is really what we want. Let's get to, to our let's get to our boy EG boys. Geronimo! Let's get off the horse now! Hit! Run to the grace! Oh this this is fine, yeah. 
nothing to worry about. Absolutely nothing to be worried about. Right, we're making incremental progress here. Slowly but surely we're whittling down the map. Woo! <laughs> Just get this. Get this. Yay! Intelligence not crystal tier acquired. Perfect. Uh, if I remember correctly, there should be the a crystal tier either here or here, which gets us plus 10 to dexterity, and then we can wield the moon veil. Okay, another one's over to my left. Another... What the... Guys, did you see that? That's so many other ones. If you get to Boil Prawn Shack, we can probably find a way. Yep. <laughs> the invisible Radagons strike again. Okay, let's roll to our destination. That's not going to happen. Nope. Now I'm just in a worse spot. Fuck you, Radagon! <laughs> you can grab that grace. Okay, that's actually good. This battalion doesn't actually patrol... Okay, they're fighting each other. I repeat, the Radagons are fighting each other. Alright, uh, this looks absolutely perfectly normal. Nothing to worry about here. Just a couple of bros exchanging some punches. Alright, now we just need to find a path through all of those Radagons. And why are these guys just circling around? <laughs> what are these guys doing? It always goes like that. Okay, it's impossible to get to the shack. It's literally impossible. Like, there has to be a way to get to there. Just has to be. Maybe... Like, we don't need to go down the bridge. Maybe we can go, like, here. This lake is just a disaster. There is no enemies here. Did I actually manage... Oh, yes, baby. Perfect, perfect. Okay, I like your outfit, Bogart. That's a good outfit. I just want the crystal tear. Okay, he's pushing me actually towards my goal. Perfect. Dexterity crystal tear acquired. Perfect. One, two... Three, four. Perfect. Plus four moon veil shreds. Dexterity intelligence. Perfect. Let's go back and kill the red wolf. Oh, fuck. Oh, come on. Why you body block me? Oh, my God. If you don't make it, you will break it. Or he will break you. Moon veil. He can parry moon veil. What the fuck? <laughs> this is literally a practice run for future speedruns. Get wrecked, Radagon. Good fight. <gasps> Alright, let's try to attempt this, boys. It's probably not going to be too hard. It, it's two Radagons, one after another, so we need to get good here. Yeah. Good fight, Radagon. Next one incoming. Okay. And he's dead. Wait, no, he's not dead. And he's dead. Good fight. Good fight, Radagon. Queen of the full moon. Renala, you can stop whining. I've brought the Radagons to your house. Like, there is a Radagon behind you, there is like 10,000 Radagons in front of you. You have no more reason to whine. Let's go to Volcano Manor. Kill me! Alright, perfect, it works. We are still able to... What?! Okay, the Radagon is going into... Shit, oh fuck. <laughs> this might be impossible, because we need to take a lot of damage to actually get to him. This might be another killer, not gonna lie. We might not be able to get through this place without dying like a bunch. Something hit me for some reason. What? I'm light rolling. What the hell are other ones? So close though. We need to get into that hole. Once we get into that hole, we should be fine. That would have been a smarter thing. Oh, immediately he attacks. Okay, Radagon. On the second that I land, he attacks. On the millisecond, actually. In a spot where Radagons do so much damage. Why? Like, come. Christ almighty. Just light roll, just light roll. Fuck! Calculated! Fuck! There is three run- oh shit! No! Thanks! No! <laughs> It's possible, it's definitely possible. Yes! The Radagons are actually following me, this is insane. There is more than two Radagons over here. Touch Grace! Yes! We are safe! Hopefully. Oh fuck, we are not safe! <laughs> we are relatively safe, we are, we are safer. Yes! 
Yes, I managed to teleport to the table hood. Okay, I'm actually insane. If you teleport fast enough, you can actually escape. Oh lord, I'm I'm free. I've just escaped literal hell. I think it's about time we tackle Stormvale, guys. This is why I thought... I'm just gonna accept my death. How my life is actually in a miracle. One down. Moonvale OP, guys. Bye-bye. Christ almighty. Who is shooting at me? He is shooting through the goddamn ceiling. Yeah, this, ha this has to be a joke. Oh my god, I cannot even heal. This is the worst game ever. <laughs> this is the worst game create. Oh my god, will you let me kill this guy? Thank you. My... Will you stop? Cr stop it. Stop. Please. Stop it. Just get me out of this place. So get up here. And then jump. We are doing it. Light roll to victory. Radagon the Grafted. It's honestly a cool name for him, not gonna lie. Go to sleep. And we have the second Shard Bearer, which is pretty good. Give me Renala's outfit. Yeah. Now we are actually ready. But I'm going to find a way. Even at the darkest of times, there is always a way. Yeah, I'm being stupid. Let's go get Bloodhound Step. Now we just go over here. We can get Rot- Oh! And there he goes. Knights Radagon cheese, ladies and gentlemen. 42k souls, that's a lot, and Bloodhound Step, perfect. Now let's pray to the all-known, almighty father, Greater Will, that this is going to be enough. He's still able to hit me. Yes! No! What? God damn it, come on. Quit out, quit out, quit out, oh, 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 oh. Do not, and I repeat, screw up the boss fight. <laughs> why did I screw up the goddamn boss fight, man? Why? I'm gonna leave you to kill to me dying by other ones. <laughs> Perfect finish, good fight. We made it to Altus, boys. We made it to Altus. Ah, oh, beautiful Altus Plateau. Infested with Radagons, but it's still beautiful. I think actually going with Ria's questline is probably the best way to do it. So we tr we're gonna try to get to this place here, and then we're gonna see how that goes. Okay, Ria, I absolutely love the outfit. Oh, this is perfect. This looks like a BDSM outfit. Jesus Christ, what the hell? To Volcano Manor we go. Okay. Tanif, you are looking absolutely fine. Okay, Tanif is actually quite pretty. There is our goal. Now, how do we get to it, though? Okay, there's a bunch of other ones in this place. Oh, Lord. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, there's another other one. What the hell? Okay, these guys actually do a lot of damage. The pro <laughs> this is not going to work. Let's go do a quick little gangbang on Radagon, Star Scourge Radagon, and then we're gonna try to get back into Volcano Man. I'm not giving up on the Serpent Hunter. There's something to happen. Christ of might. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Radagon! Stop it, bro! Alright, Star Scourge Radagon. Let's see what you got, man. Finally, a fight that's actually fair. <laughs> now, instead of the Radagons ganging up on me, they're actually ganging up on him. You, my boy. Hang on, boy. Repost to finish it off. Star Scourge are down. Down. Uh, Remembrance of the Star Scourge might be useful later on because we can get his bow. And his bow is pretty good, so I'm gonna hold on to that one. Let's try to go into Leyendale first. And then we're gonna see our next course of action. There's like 10 Radagons over there. I need to kill this guy to get through here. Come here. Hopefully no other Radagon aggros. Okay, perfect. 
This is a lot worse than I originally thought. I mean, there is a grace over there. Just, just need to get to the grace somehow. Okay, so that grace over there is off limits completely. Okay, Draconic 3 Radagon. Let's go. Good fight. We have access to the capital, boys. We have access to the capital. It requires... Okay, this is perfect. Yeah, this is perfect. 6,500. Okay. Okay, I don't imagine we're going to be fighting a lot of Radagons here, so... Let's put on Blowhound Step. Totally don't jinx it. <laughs> what the... I didn't imagine another one's immediately, not going to lie. I'm a bit confused. It's the only like good way to do it. There's a rather one over here. We jump! Oh shit. Put this on, just for safety, and let's go. Alright, oh, okay. The tree over there might prove to be a gigantic problem. We only have one course of action here. Run and pray for the best. I don't see another way around. <laughs> no! Lee, there's way too many of them. Christ. Oh my god. Poggers! Yo, we actually made the first try. This is amazing. Goodbye! First Elden Lord down. It's so nice actually fighting him when you don't need to use spells. Good fight, Radagon. Radagon, the Omen King down. We only have the mountain tops, crumbling Pharaoh Mazula, and that's it. Just go, just go watch both of those speedruns and you'll see why. Wait, where did you come from? What? Why are there four Radagons here? I'll accept my death. Oh, you came down from the rafters. Okay, then I need to sneak past you. Okay, okay, okay. We are getting through, guys. We are getting through. Okay, we are not getting... Oh! I rather going. What the... Okay, quit out. Just, just quit out. Yeah. Of course, there is another Radagon there. Squid out, squid out. I didn't damage squid out. Oh my god, Radagons! Oh my god! Okay, this place is an absolute hellhole. Let's cast this. And book it. Christ almighty, Radagon. <gasps> yes! Okay, whoo! The problem here, if you haven't realized already, the enemies have started to do a lot of damage. Now we need to figure out in this fog where the other ones are located. This place is... this is... we haven't made... it's not much better. Why is that poison here? I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Oh lord, they do so much damage. Oh, this is... Ba this is these are basically final boss other ones at this point. I'm dead of poisoning. Who poisoned me? Okay, it's possible to run through at least. Okay, let's use some other Metal Guild sort of tactics. Come here, Radagons. They're gonna try to kill the rest of the Radagons with gravity. If they use gravity against me, I'm gonna use gravity against them. Bye-bye, Radagon. Where is the other one? Christ, Christ, they will do so much damage. Oh my god, the Forbidden Lands are actually crazy. The Forbidden Lands are actually insane. That was a wild journey right now. Okay, uh, good thing is there is a stake of America here. Bad thing... The bad thing here is that there's, a ba there's way too many other ones here. There is no way we survive this, right? This is just the worst place ever. If I just roll, if I just roll, I might be able to do this. Okay, we are safe. The Radagons have either died or lost interest. Okay, there are two other ones over there. There's one over there as well, so we need to go, like, down here. And there are two other ones more! Yay! Bro! The goal is going to Volcano Manor right now. Again! Leave me alone! We need Bloodhound Step for this. 
I actually don't know where where to go. Oh yeah, the guys, the Albert are actually rather ones as well. Let's pop this and let's see what's going to happen. Bro, in this place there is absolutely okay. Oh my lord, in Christ in heaven, okay, okay. Of course, he immediately shoots me in front of all the other Radagons. <laughs> that was just bad luck. Let's try this again. Okay, okay. Is this a plus? This is a plus six, right? Yeah, this is plus six. Let's go. Yo, this might work. <laughs> Who would have thought that's going to happen? Who would have thought? Okay. With a quit out, we can definitely do this. Goodbye, Radagon. The Radagons have legitimately broken everything. Get over here, right? I can't. Ah, goodbye. God skin Radagon down, boys. <laughs> okay, there should be a little. There should be a billion. There should be billion Radagons here, right? Oh yeah, we are not getting through here. No way in hell. Maybe if he managed to actually, like, throw them off the edge, we'll... Okay, the Radagon down there is cheating. He fell down! One down. 17 more to go. Get here, get down, get down. Now the Radagons up there are not as much of a problem. We can actually quit out once we are in this room. Come to the teleporter! Yeah! Let's fucking... What?! Okay, we've gotten the Serpent Hunter. Radagon Devouring Serpent, okay. So it's gonna be two Radagons. <laughs> I staggered you out of it, good fight. Good fight. Radagon Lord of Blasphemy in the pocket. And I'm not sure why Rykard is already here. Here is my plan of taking care of all of the Radagons. We are gonna shoot them with a Great Bow. Because I don't see a better way to do this. Oh, we, we, can, actually, we can actually just fight him here. Good fight. Now we just run away. What? Why did you aggro? This makes no sense. Why did three Radagons aggro on me? Like we are abusing the Joe Star strategy here all day, every day. He run away from everything that has your legs. Okay, we are gonna use something that nobody has ever used in their playthroughs. This. Let's see where the Radagons are. Look at these guys. Okay, we are gonna climb up over here, avoiding all of the Radagons because there aren't too many of them if you stick to the edge. We are gonna go to the invisible bridge over there. And on the invisible bridge, we're gonna go skip all over to... We're gonna skip basically this entire lake over here. We still need to get around the algamation of Radagons in this place. So using the invisible... Ooh, these Radagon hurts like hell, oh my... I need to do this a little bit sneakier, it seems. Does this shit actually tell me where I need to go? I need to follow the white light, boys. Follow the white light. Can we actually do something here? Like this and then avoid this Radagon? There are way too many patrolling Radagons here. Okay, okay, avoid the explosions, avoid the explosions. Did that Radagon fall down? Yes, he did. Okay, okay. Uh, goodbye, Radagon. Bye-bye. See you later. This is legitimately going to be a disaster. <gasps> Three Radagons have aggroed. Okay, we might have a chance here, boys. Yeah, look. They can only fall down if they kind of like idle walk. If they... Hey, there we go. One down. Even though we killed all of the side Radagons. Like, I think I killed like 10 Radagons up to this point. And because I'm killing Radagons constantly, I'm... Go away! Yes! We are through. Let's get the hell out of here. Imagine if I just fall off here and die. You know, I just need to get to the fire giant. Might as well book it. Assassin's Gambit is actually doing wonders here. Okay. Rest. GG. Let's go, fire Radagon. Time to meet your maker. One. Two. And no more stamina. Got out of stamina. <laughs> Good fight. That's bullshit. <laughs> uh, we've gotten to the point where Radagon's, Radagon as a boss fight is actually starting to be a big problem. <gasps> that is impossible to dodge. Fucking... Whoa. It's 
heal. Kill this guy. He's dead. He is dead. Goodbye, Radagon. Trust the sword deep inside of you. Good fight. I don't ever have to do this fight again. I'm scared about this place, guys. I'm really, I'm really scared about this place. There is a good thing here and a bad thing. The good thing is we are almost at the final run of the game. The bad thing is this place is stock filled with enemies. This is what I was afraid of. Christ, the damage that he does is insane. Some other one over here. Book it, Toto, book it. Touch Grace. I feel like for some reason Radagon is doing a lot more damage than usually. Woo. Touch Grace. Oh Christ. Okay, okay. This is gravity time, I think, here. Yeah, this is gravity time. Okay, these guys are a piece of cake because we can just shoot them over here. And they will all fall down to gravity. Basically, what I've learned in this run is that if you think you killed all the enemies, you probably didn't. Just Bloodhound step to victory. And also, he's gonna spawn over here. <laughs> he spawns all the way back. Oh, God, it's Godskin Radagon, boys. Oh, amazing. <laughs> I thought that was going to kill. Good fight, Godskin Radagon. Okay, guys, we are at the bird part. So I'm gonna now shut up and see how I'm going to deal with this. I'm dead. Couldn't move. <laughs> Okay, we can do this, we can do this. We can go over to the platform and then reset the aggro and we're gonna be fine. Why is the lightning shooting and the dragon is still not there? I'm fighting red lightning, this is not supposed to be here. What is the red lightning here? This makes no sense. This just might be possible. This just might be possible. We can actually quit out over here. This might be not as bad as I thought. Quit outs are good. Oh, what? Why did he just... He just vanish out of reality. What? Bye bye! What? <gasps> that was so lucky that I survived that. That was so lucky. Oh my... I need, need to take less risks. I actually heard his footstep. That's why I turned around at the right time. Goodbye. The closed spaces are actually perfect for us as well. They help the Radagons and they help us. Because they block all of their shots. I might not be able to go up the elevator. Not if I quit out. I need to quit out here. There is no way I'm going up the elevator if I don't quit out. We have officially made it. There is nothing else that can actually thwart our plans. It's over, guys. The run is over. Now we just need to kill five Radagons. GG. Come on, another one. Oh! <laughs> Broke his knees! <laughs> you and your minions have put up a valiant effort, but... It was not enough, unfortunately. Good fight. Elden Ring with every enemy being Radagon, done. The Radagons are passive! Okay, not, not all of them. <laughs> not all of them! The Radagons are actually quite passive, what the hell? They're not attacking me at all. I'm just walking through a bunch of Radagons, what the hell is going on? And I'm just dreaming about Radagons at this point. Okay, this is hell. 
I accept this, the Legion of Radagons, boys. The Mo has definitely had some good plans in his world. Mo definitely knows what's up. He knows what army he needs to get. The army of Radagons, boys. Jesus Christ.